Hello, nerds. Thank you for watching Generally Nerdy. This is your Week in Nerddom TV edition for the week of April 2nd, 2018. This week in TV news, TV's actually our shortest video this week. So we've got some Star Trek, Legion, Deadpool stuff, a whole lot's going on. Uh, though not as much as most weeks, so let's hit that intro real quick so we can get this done and over with, shall we? Quiet on the set, rolling. Hi, I am Bitsy Tellick. Hey, I'm Hale Appleman. I'm Walter Kane. I'm Rene Auvergenois. Odo on Deep Space Nine. Michael Dorn, Lieutenant Commander Worf, Star Trek The Next Generation. Uh, come and see me and hear me and talk to me and listen to me and talk about myself. Hey man, this is Kevin Smith, often considered generally nerdy, and you are listening to what is often considered generally nerdy. On Generally Nerdy. You're listening to Generally Nerdy. Generally Nerdy. Generally Nerdy. Before we hit up that news, guys, let's hit up a sponsor real quick. This week's episode is sponsored by patreon.com slash generally nerdy. This is the place to go so that you can contribute directly. You can become, literally become a part of this conversation. If you contribute all the way up to the $10 a month bracket, then I will put you in an episode of your week in nerddom or whatever other episode you so desire. We will figure out a way and you will be a part of that. Or if for $5 a month, you contribute directly, you help me talk about these uh, talking points that we that we have in every episode so definitely check out patreon.com slash generally nerdy and now let's jump into some news first on the list this week we're talking about star trek discovery just a real quick update we knew it was coming it's just officially happened now star trek discovery just got uh signed on for 13 more episodes for season two so we will be getting a season two it, I mean, I don't know if anyone was ever actually questioning that, but now it's official, so there you go. It's it's pretty decent. I was I was not expecting it to be as good as it is, so I am interested to see what season two has. But that's all we've got on that, so let's kick on next to Legion. We are just a, like a week away, maybe two weeks away. I can't remember the date, and of course I didn't write it down, but we are not very far out from the premiere of season two over on FX. And we just got a first look video over on the uh, Fox, I believe, on their YouTube channel. So link to the video is down in the description. And yeah, it's the, there's also a new trailer. I'll see if I can find a link for that, which will also be in the description. I can't believe I didn't watch this show when it was on to begin with. I just binge watched the entire season one, uh, two days ago. And yeah, it's really good. This is, this is right up there with like walking dead and game of thrones it's that good and it's it's cinematography wise it's even better in a lot of cases so this show i'm super excited for season two are you guys as excited as i am because just it looks like this is just the beginning of the crazy there's so much more crazy it looks like that's coming in this next season but uh i don't know you you guys let's have that conversation down in the comments uh, and we're going to kick over to the next bit of news, and that is Deadpool. And everybody, we've talked, we talked last week about the cancellation of Deadpool, but since that's happened, it looks like Ryan Reynolds is trying to pull, or Ryan Reynolds, uh, <laughs> Donald Glover is trying to pull a Ryan Reynolds. So, yeah, I mean, and what do I mean by that? Uh, he leaked some test footage, test footage, of the animated Deadpool series that he just got canceled, and also leaked some script pages about the, probably the day after I did the, the last week's recording. Yeah, it was like Monday or Tuesday of last week. So leaked the script pages that they weren't the actual script pages. It was a theoretical season finale or potentially series finale. And then we've had his brother come out and talk about different things uh, about how they had an episode that was bashing on Taylor Swift and that was the final straw with FX and so much is going on right now. But it seems that, again, they leaked this footage in hopes that maybe they could pull a Deadpool movie out of their butts and, and 
get the fan outcry to be so loud that FX just went, ah, screw it, let's make the dang show. I I hope it works. I really, really hope it works. All of the footage, I would post a link down low, but all of the footage has been pulled by Titmouse uh, Entertainment or Incorporated or whatever uh, the company is. It, it's also the company that has a lot of stuff over on the Adult Swim block of programming on Cartoon Network. So, very, very interesting. It, it, there's screenshots everywhere. I'll, I mean, you're looking at a screenshot right here. This is from that however long the animation was. Uh, hopefully somebody else will have downloaded it and then redistributed it onto the internet. But as it stands right now, that's not a thing. So we gotta move over. And we're already to the last bit of news. Um, we're running at like five minutes on this, this week's episode. It happens. I mean, every now and then there's not a whole lot going on in TV news, right? The last bit is lock and key. It seems that Hulu has passed on making the show. They they paid for two pilot episodes and then went, eh, yeah, we're going to go a different direction. Um, I honestly thought that because that they they paid for you know they they greenlit a second pilot episode that there was just little things they had to work out so it was basically a done deal they just needed that uh, uh proof of execution and it seems i was totally wrong but idw entertainment and showrunner carlton cruz entertainment producer and also the pilot director andy M muschietti hey i think i got that right <laughs> are reportedly uh, holding screenings for other distri distribution options, so other channels and other streaming options. They're, they're not going to give up on this show, and more power to them. I really feel like Lock and Key is one that a lot more people would appreciate if it was in a, a, a TV form. I know, I know my girlfriend is a big Lock and Key reader, and Joe Hill is quite the writer, so... Definitely, as far, and also as far as I know, Joe Hill is going to be involved at least in an oversight capacity with the series. So I don't understand how Hulu could pass on that. That doesn't make any sense to me. But they did, and now this is where we're at. So hopefully next week we'll have an update that a different channel or streaming service has picked up this Lock and Key series. And it's not just going to be one of those projects that dies by the wayside. That is the end of the TV episode this week, guys. What did I miss, guys? What should we talk about next week? There's bound to be something I missed because we only had the four talking points, right? So let me know in the comments down low. If, though, you want to go deeper into the conversation, jump over to the website, generallynerdy.net. You can find all of the social media links up there, all of the freebies. Again, I'm trying to get more written stuff up there, but I've got a lot on my plate these days, so it's still a little difficult to sit down and write 600 words. But it happens from, uh, from time to time, and you can see all of that stuff over on the website. Also on the website are the links to the stores, so you can get your very own Generally Nerdy shirt. Not just this one, there's a lot of shirts up there, so go check it out. But if you would rather contribute a little more directly, there's a Patreon site that you can go check out, patreon.com slash generally nerdy. That is where you can support, you can jump on for just a dollar a month. There are more tiers. The higher up you go, the more cool stuff you get. So check out the Patreon page, patreon.com slash generally nerdy for all of that information. If you are new to this channel though, click that subscribe button right next to the subscribe button. There's a thumbs up. If you like this episode, click the, that thumbs up button. Let me know you liked it. Or if you didn't like the episode, go ahead and click the thumbs down. Just let me know. If you are falling behind on your nerd news and you want to catch up, then click or tap that box to the left of my face to do that. Right above that, you will see the Adventures in Photography playlist, a link to that. You can go check that out, and if you are so inclined, let me know what you want to see in a new Adventure in Photography video, because we are going to be filming two of them in the month of April. So jump on over there, check that out. But before you go do any of that, then please always, always remember that if it's generally nerdy, it's probably here.